Isn't this just beautiful? I'm right off the road. So you got the truck parked there. Right above a culvert. Which I, uh, I won't be standing on today. But I think I'll stand just over here. Take a nice picture on a nice low angle. And I'd like to get that stump. You see the, uh, the, that old stump there. You really want that out of the reflection like this. So it stands out a little bit. You don't want to hide stuff like that in reflections like that. So that's what I'm going to go for. And then I'm going to uh, keep driving along the road, which uh, you see turns left in circles. And uh, see what else we could find after that. So just to give you a quick tip. Uh, what I'm doing there is uh, I'm shooting ISO 400 like I always do right off the bat. Uh, aperture is on f8 just to get a little bit more depth of field so I can see the background nice and crisp. I'm trying to get a low low angle and I'm shooting with a polarizer on my 18 to 35 mil Sigma lens. Um, autofocus and what else? My exposure compensation is like plus two, it's just a little bit overexposed. I'm just trying to bring out the whiteness in, in the snow, but it's the first snowfall of the season. It's very, very clean snow. It looks great as it is, but I, I always bump up the compensation a little bit when I'm dealing with, with snow. So uh, something you can try yourself. Um, I may take the polarizer off, but it's darkening the water really nicely. It's a nice contrast against the snow. So I'm not sure I might experiment with that, but for now, the polarizer staying on. Stay tuned uh, later in this video, <laughs> it was an episode, uh, in this video uh, I'm going to be reviewing these wonderful gloves by a wonderful company that sent me these and uh, stay tuned for that, you're not going to want to miss them. Uh, they're absolutely fantastic gloves. Yeah, so I'm going to be reviewing those later but first we're going to keep driving, take a few more photos uh, before it really starts raining because this is supposed to turn to rain so uh, while it's still here we gotta gotta keep moving okay guys I just uh, stopped quickly here to take another photo uh, it's absolutely gorgeous outside and it's super easy to take pictures today so this is great uh, I just wanted to stop though and talk to you about these gloves like I promised. Uh, typically, you know, this is how I keep my hands warm. Like most Canadians. It's a cheesy joke, but it's true. And uh, I won't be needing that as much anymore. I'll pick that up after, don't worry. But these, uh, these gloves are definitely, definitely doing the trick to keep my hands warm right now. The company is Valorette. They're a company from Norway and they were so kind they sent me a pair of these photography gloves. They're called the Markov Pro 2.0. So these gloves are absolutely uh, perfect for this time of year. I think up until December these will be really great at keeping my hands warm. Uh, January and February when it's like minus 35, sometimes minus 40 degrees Celsius, I, th I think these aren't going to hold up but pick them up again in March, April, um, perfect for this time of year. They're absolutely wonderfully made. It's a company from Norway. They are photographers themselves and it really, really shows in the design of these gloves. The number one favorite thing I like about these right off the hop is just how grippy they are. You can actually hear the grip sticking on the palms and it holds the camera wonderfully and if you watch my videos you know I don't use camera straps I hate them they get caught on everything um, the only time I've ever dropped a camera is because the camera strap got caught on something ever since then I, I haven't used them and it's almost like I'm holding it with bare hands with these gloves they are a very well padded glove but they're such a snug fit and they're designed to fit snugly that it doesn't feel like a big thick glove. But they are. They are thick and they're very well insulated. 
Of course, they have the finger holes. I mean, what photography glove wouldn't? So for your touchscreen, LCD, your phone, that's wonderful. I personally keep my fingers tucked away nice and warm. And I've never had a problem pushing the buttons personally with, with gloves on. So I, I rarely do use that feature, but it is definitely a nice feature to have. The magnets are strong enough. When I bend my finger, the magnet stays. It doesn't flop down like some of the other gloves I've had in the past. Very strong magnets. Goat leather, water resistant. It has a very nice pocket here at the back with a weatherproof zipper that you can leave a memory card in. I shoot I shoot with SanDisk memory cards, SanDisk Extreme Pros. They're all they're already water uh, resistant memory cards, so that's going to be a great memory card to leave inside this pocket. Um, they've also included a key for your tripod inside the pocket, which is wonderful for those quick releases that don't have something to turn by hand. Very nice tight fitting around the wrist. So it's easy for your jacket to go over top of the glove. You're not constantly adjusting your clothing or anything like that. Um, one problem I have with every glove ever made is, and you guys probably do too, everything fits perfect except for the pinky. And the pinky, you're doing something like this where you're, you're folding it over and your finger is halfway up. Not with these. With these, the length of the fingers are absolutely perfect. Again, they are a snug fit and they do have a really great uh, sizing chart on their website, so check that out. I'll link the website, um, so it's a quick click for you guys, uh, right in the description of this video, so check that out if you guys are interested in these gloves. So thank you, Valorant, for sending me these. I really do appreciate it. I will... Uh, keep shooting with these for as long as I can until they're completely worn out. Maybe we'll do another review in a year and see how they hold up after a year of uh, lots of use. So, very wonderful glove. Let's keep going. Let's take more pictures. Uh, it's still snowing. It's not rain yet. It's only looking more beautiful. I really love these heavy, thick snowflakes. So, we'll keep going down the road and we'll see what we can get. Well guys, uh, that's just about it for me. I'm, I'm actually, uh, these gloves are so funny, the, the magnet's so strong, I'm losing money. I'm, I'm touching my pockets and I'm pulling money out of my pockets and the, look at these loonies sticking to the glove. That's how strong the magnet is. Anyway guys, go to the description of this video, I'll put the link to these uh, gloves in there. Check them out. Just be careful, you don't lose your car keys or your money when you put your hands in your pockets because these magnets are are very strong um, very great gloves very very well made so uh, again thanks for watching uh, thank you Valorant for sending me these uh, next video uh, hopefully we'll be putting bird seed out at the bird feeders so uh, until then we'll see you next time